Hey everyone, Tony George, Doc Sports, Saturday update, happy weekend, NBA free play, then we'll tell you about an eight unit loss we had the other night, and we'll tell you what's going on with the website today, but let's get to the freebie first. Um, and I'm going to make this short and sweet day, I'm taking the under 208. They've had one total exceed the over in this series so far, and that was by two points. They've adjusted the line down every game. They're still going under. Each of the last two games, one of the teams didn't score triple digits. Each of the last two games was 196 points. We've got a side pick in this tonight, but the total opened up at 209 and a half and dropped down to 208 and a half. I still think there's some value there on the under in this NBA game tonight for your free selection. Over at the website today, we have a six-unit top pick in Major League Baseball on a three-pack. Uh, we've cased our last three top picks all within the last week and a half. Um, we are on a $3,985 run since May 5th to the good for a $100 player in baseball. That's the hype. Uh, Four-unit NBA best bet, as we mentioned, on the side pick in this game tonight. We have a four-unit WNBA game of the day, and we have a four-unit NBA player prop. Cased our last three cards. Just cherry-picking them four units at a time, one at a time, one a day. Tortoise and the hare fable. Slow and steady wins the race. Going to cherry-pick another very cheap line tonight. Man, couldn't believe it when I saw it. Speaking of, uh, for, pardon me about that. Let me turn my phone off. Live video, who cares, right? Um, we had eight unit loss the other night. I had the over in the Denver and Minnesota game. Uh, my largest personal wager of the season in the NBA. Um, if you'd have told me that you knew that Denver, the defending NBA champions, with the league MVP on their team, who had averaged 115 points per game over the last three games and were kind of putting their foot down on Minnesota's throat, that they would score 70 points and get beat by 45. If you'd have told me that in advance, or you'd have told me that after the fact, that you knew that that was going to happen, you're a liar. I'm dumbfounded by it. I've been, I've, I've been surprised doing this for 32 years. I mean, I've seen stuff that at bad beats you can't possibly imagine of the hundreds of thousands of games that I've wagered and lost and won and everything in between. I did not see that coming. I don't think anybody. How can you score 70? The Portland, the worst teams in the league, Blazers could have scored 90. And they threw in the towel. 70 points get beat by 45. I mean, I'll accept the blame. I feel bad about it. Um, it's taken me 24 hours to kind of shake it off. But nonetheless, this these playoffs have been, I mean, one team wins by 31 night. The other team wins by 32 nights later. It's back and forth. There's no consistency. It's uh, a frightening concept, for lack of a better term, unless you can get a real angle on it. Um, so we think we got we got the right position tonight for the side pick for you to make up four units for you. Um, don't forget um, to sign up, subscribe, thumbs up, free $60, link in the description below or a tab on the website. Park 60 bucks in a new account. No obligation. Use it anywhere on the website you want to. So be sure and take advantage of that. Free golf picks on Twitter at T George Sports. Daily head to heads in the PGA Championship. Uh, I just got a news alert that Scotty Scheffler did make it to the court today without getting arrested. Unreal. Just unreal. <laughs> just when you think you've seen it all. Yeah, the world's number one golfer, you know, in jail. Unreal. And then goes out and fires a five under, is in the top three. Unreal. 